Hey guys, 7th WD Rocks here, and last night we saw the Raw Go Home Show to Payback. Uh, I, it was raining, it was raining hard, it was supposed to rain all week, so I, I missed some of it. Some of the, you know, TV went out for a few few minutes, so I missed some main segments, but I think I caught the, you know, the main picture of it. But, um, the card for Payback looks decent. It was a pay-per-view like Payback, I'm not expecting very much. But, um, if this, if this, if you guys can understand this, I think it's a pay-per-view that really could have decent match that decent matches on the card, but the but the matches themselves will just blow us away because I feel like it's a lot of younger guys are getting more opportunities without the WWE Championship match not even being on the card. I feel like if somebody can step up big, and I feel like this is the pay per view to do it. If uh, you want to make your mark in the WWE, I feel like this pay per view is the best time to do it. Guys like Cesaro, um, RVD can do it. Wade Barrett, uh, Sheamus. Um, I know El Torito and Hornswoggle go over seeing each other in a match. If it's anything like their last match, it'll be awesome. But without the TLC stuff, I don't see how they can do a, um, a fun match like the last time. I know Paige versus, uh, oh, what's her name? Uh, Alicia Fox. She's doing that crazy gimmick, that gimmick where she's like freaking out after all her matches and like going insane and slapping guys. She gave a guy a wedgie last night and stuff like that. I don't know how I feel about that, but it's interesting to see, I guess, her how she does the character. But I, I don't see her winning the title, so it really doesn't matter. I will do my predictions video whenever you guys want to. Evolution vs. Shield, I know, will be good no matter what. It's going to be uh, no holds barred elimination match. That'll be awesome. John Cena vs. Bray Wyatt, with being at last man standing, I feel like this could be the best match out of their three. But I'm not expecting the best match. But, um, yeah, so, uh, uh, NXT, NXT TakeOvers this Thursday. Let me know if you guys want to see my predictions of that. I'll, I'll do it tomorrow if you guys do want to see it, so comment if you do. But if you don't, that's fine. Um, Payback, I'm not, you know, it's not going to probably be the best pay-per-view, but I feel like some matches could really blow us away that we weren't expecting. But, so let me know what you guys think of Payback. I know a lot of good matches there, but Brian and him not having a WWE Championship match, I don't know how I feel about that. Some matches really, really going to have to blow me away. But so, like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. Let me know what you guys think. I'll do a predictions video this weekend for Payback. And if you want to see an NXT TakeOver predictions video, let me know. Like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. And as always, have a nice day. Thank you, guys.